Hello and welcome. My name is Christina from Empowered Creator. I am a mindset and conscious manifesting teacher and coach, and this is my YouTube channel. Here I talk about all things law of assumption, mindset, conscious manifesting, the quantum universe, and a lot more. And my goal is to simplify everything without the fluff. So if you guys like this content and you would like to see more of it, I would love it if you would subscribe to this channel, comment on this video, like it, share it, and stick around. Also, if you need help with your specific situation, I offer one-on-one -on -one coaching, email coaching, as well as custom subliminals for whatever needs you may have. I also have a self-study mini course, telepathically connect with your specific person. So if you guys are interested in any of these services, the links are below in the description box. Click on them and they're going to take you to my website. With all that being said, let's dive into today's video. In today's video, I wanted to talk about what is the key to successful and fast manifestation. And for that, I wanted to borrow a teaching from one of the most famous contemporary teachers of the law, Dr. Joe Dispenza, and talk about the whole concept of heart-brain coherence. So this is what I'll be discussing in today's video. Stay tuned. So I know a few weeks ago, I asked you guys what teachers of the law you wanted me to discuss. And several of you asked for teachings from Dr. Joe Dispenza. I do agree that he's one of the most important contemporary teachers of the law. He has done significant work on the subject. He has written books, he is doing workshops, he's giving speeches, he's very, very active teaching the law. And one of his most famous teachings and one of his most important teachings, if you ask me, that's my opinion, is the whole concept of heart-brain coherence. So I wanted to discuss this concept today in this video. I wanted to explain it and simplify it for you guys and then also explain why it's so important and why it truly is actually the key to easy, fast, successful manifestation. So first of all, what is this concept of heart-brain coherence? This is the concept that essentially says that your thoughts and your feelings, what you feel within your body, how you feel within your body about your manifestation, need to agree. And Joe Dispenza has also taken it a bit further where he explains that our thoughts form electric fields, our feelings form magnetic fields, and so the sum total of our thoughts and our feelings forms an electromagnetic field that actually determines what we get to manifest in our lives. To make it a little simpler and to give some examples of that, let's say you're manifesting a relationship and you're having a lot of resistance around that. So let's say that you are trying to just go with your mind and force your mind to think all the thoughts that you think you should be thinking. So for example, they want me, they love me, they want to be with me, they're choosing me, they want a relationship with me, etc., etc. But the feelings that arise within your body with these thoughts are actually feelings of resistance, feelings of anxiety, feelings of um, doubt, feelings of insecurity, feelings of fear, and so on. If this is the case, you're actually not having heart-brain coherence, at least not in those moments. Because while your mind might be saying one thing, your heart and your body is telling a very different story. And usually it's our bodies and how we feel that tell the truth about how we're feeling about the situation or about whatever it is that we're manifesting. Because while it's much easier to quote-unquote manipulate our thoughts and make our mind think what we want it to think, However, our body might be protesting. Our body might not be believing it. Our body might be bringing up resistance. It might be bringing up anxiety. It might be uh, bringing up stress, fears, insecurities, doubts, and so on. And this is exactly why I often tell you guys that when you do your techniques, whatever technique it is that you're doing, do whatever feels natural to you. It doesn't really matter that you need to take it to a deeper level where you actually feel a difference within your body because this is how you achieve true heart and brain coherence. And this is how you know that you have an agreement between your mind and your body. And once you have that agreement, once you have achieved that agreement between your mind and your body, you can rest assured that if you revisit that often, and if you sustain that over a period of time, there is no way your manifestation is not going to come because you have complete total agreement between your mind and your body. In other words, to use Joe Dispenza's concept, you are vibrating in an electromagnetic field that is consistent to your manifestation. It's consistent to your wishful field and to the state of having your desire. And I've talked before about what that feeling is. It doesn't have to be anything exaggerated. It doesn't have to be anything elaborate. You don't have to be bouncing off the walls in excitement, nothing like that. 
If you're feeling a calm feeling, if you're feeling reassured, if you're feeling relieved, if you're feeling some sort of gratitude or some sort of inner contentment and inner fulfillment, that is it. That is the feeling. So you have the thoughts, you're thinking the thoughts that you want, and you have that corresponding feeling within your body where your body is feeling reassured that yes, this is going to happen. This is my desire. This is done. This is my manifestation. It's coming for me. Then your mind and your heart your mind and your body are in agreement. And let me also give another example. I know a lot of you have complained that what you fear tends to manifest fast. First of all, I'm going to tell you this is an assumption. You don't have to have that assumption. You don't have to assume that my fears manifest. But the reason why that happens, and especially it happens to people who are newbies in manifesting or who are not trained in conscious manifesting, and it most commonly happens unconsciously, is because fear tends to create very distinct feelings within our body. And so if on our mind we're dwelling on the thing we're fearing, on the thing that we're fearing is going to happen to us, and our body reacts in a way that corresponds with what we have in our mind, then this is why a lot of us, actually probably most of us, have the unfortunate experience of something that we were intensely fearing actually manifested and in some cases manifested really, really fast. The good news though is that we can do the same thing with our desires. We can learn, we can train ourselves to connect our mind with our body, to feel into our thoughts, to feel into our assumptions, to feel into the techniques that we're doing and that we're practicing so that we feel a different feeling within our body. We feel a difference, we feel a shift in our body, in how we're feeling, in how we're perceiving the situation. And this is, you guys, how we're achieving mind and heart coherence or brain and heart coherence, brain and heart connection. You will hear it said in different ways by different coaches. They're all different words to describe the same thing. So this is why this is key to successful manifestation and actually fast manifestation. Because once you're able to align your mind with your body and have them agree and be coherent with each other and correspond with each other, actually Neville talked about a very similar concept, you know that you are on track for fast, successful manifestation. If you're able to consistently bring your mind and your body, your heart, to agree with each other, you know that your manifestation cannot be very far. This takes some training. This takes some practice. Don't let it intimidate you. It's not intimidating at all. It's just a matter of practice and a matter of training yourself to get into that state. And once you do, you're going to see that it becomes easier and easier to call these states on demand, to align your brain with your heart on demand. And this has the double benefit of, number one, making you feel much, much better instantly. And number two, if it's sustained and if it's revisited over and over, it is the key to faster, easier, successful manifestation. With all that being said, I'm going to wrap up this video here. I intend that this has helped. As always, I very much appreciate you guys being on this channel, watching this content. I love making this content for you. And as always, I look forward to seeing you all at the next video. Until then, take care and bye-bye.